careful here. Earlier tonight, we had a drunk driver roll her vehicle into the bayou, and initially we were told that she was the only person in the vehicle at that time. Several hours later, we received information that the driver may have, in fact, had a passenger riding with her that didn't make it out. It's pretty creepy. It's, it's kind of scary because you don't know what you're going to grab or what's going to grab you. <laughs> you hope nothing grabs you. Really? It's pitch black. I can't see my hand in front of my face. I'm feeling around, and I feel clothing. And I don't know if there's anything else attached to that. I grab a hold of it so I can get it out of the vehicle. Right, Thankfully, there wasn't anything attached to it. I felt all the way across the back part. I, gotta... I didn't feel anybody. I couldn't feel anybody up here. Just some clues. 140, that's going to be a negative on a person in the side of the vehicle. Not that I could find, anyway. In my opinion, it's not that big of a risk for us to do that, because it's just something that we do. Well, now I do have to go home and change. Yeah, OK, sure. I felt a lot better knowing that we did absolutely everything we could to see if there was anyone left in that vehicle, whether they be dead or alive. Be safe, be strong. Let's do this. Get that stretcher in here. You're going to bleed to death. Grab the knife. Grab the knife. They're not dead. I can work with that.